What's up everybody, today we're going to check out a queen called Hedera Hashcraft because this queen is basically exploding. We're going to check out what this queen is about, why it's going up, and what's going to be the price prediction for this coin. So if you are interested in this coin, do watch the entire video to understand what will happen to this coin. So let's begin. But before we start guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video. Right now we're at 31,000 subscribers, let's go to that 32,000 number. Without you guys, the channel just wouldn't even exist, so thank you so much for watching. Let's all together go to the moon here we are in core market cap as you can see right now the market cap for this coin is five billion dollars which is a huge market cap so 15 percent up in the last 24 hours as you can see the volume also did skyrocket here so 23 percent up 1.2 billion volumes you just check out the graph here seeing that the volume like the whole the price of this coin has been just skyrocketing if you go here to seven days you can just see how much this coin has been actually going up and how insane this truly is and just how how much this coin has been going up in the end so 207,000 watch list which is an awesome number here so a lot of people are interested into this coin if you go here to the market basically we can see everywhere we can buy the coin so binance cool coin of course if you are interested you can purchase the coin so okx and so many different exchanges so let's go let's go to their website let's see what's going to happen here to this coin like what this coin is really all about so it says here hello future ensuring decentralized governance at scale so oh yeah the 16th of september that's gonna be tomorrow and it says here join us for the second year anniversary live stream of hedera's open access so i believe just because it is, there's another chance this coin should be able to explode or right after that they're basically going to have a, a massive correction so there are two possibilities where the coin will explode just because of that if, if they do release some good news or basic that we're gonna break down because we have like this coin has been going up for the last couple of days here. So Hedera is owned and governed by the world's leading organizations. So we got Google here, Chainlink Labs, IBM, LG, and so many different companies, like huge companies here, which is just insane to see. So join the future built on trust. Hedera is the most used most used enterprise grade public network for you to make your digital world exactly as it should be. Yours it should be yours hbar let's call it hbar is the native energy efficient cryptocurrency of hedera that powers the decentralized economy whether you're a startup or enterprise a creator or a consumer hedera goes beyond blockchain for developers to create the next era of fast fair and secure applications so you can just see here that we have like bitcoin ethereum and hedera here so basically transactions per second so three plus uh 12 plus 10,000 plus average fee is like 20, 22, uh, $22 uh, for Ethereum is like 19. It's not 19 for Ethereum right now. I think it's like 50 bucks, 30 to 50 bucks basically. So that's super expensive. This one it says here it's 0 0.0001. So a fraction of a penny. That's insane. This action confirmation, it's, it's 10 to 60 minutes, 10 to 20 seconds three to five seconds insane energy use per transaction so 885 kilowatts the 102 kilowatts 0 0.00017 kilowatts so eco-friendly it's not using too much electricity too much power and that's it so super cool to see so you check out if you do want so it's a decentralized trust for any applications for innovative innovative startups to global enterprises developers entrepreneurs and businesses are decentralizing the future of hedera so you can check it out if you do want so all of these platforms all of these tokens also it's pretty cool look at this network metrics right now so we can check out the dashboard also but three th over three three million actually transactions per day which is insane latency 5.7 seconds to finality so everything is done basically in five to six seconds so that's it it's insanely fast accounts 423,000 accounts on mainnet and api calls 5,000 per h bar which is awesome just awesome to see i'm hopefully pronouncing it right if i'm not do remind me in the comment do tell me how it is pronounced like is it h bar is it hedera hopefully um i am pronouncing it right so yeah pretty cool to see what's been happening to, to this coin it is an interesting blockchain so if you go here to the dashboard actually can i check out yes i can, I can check out the dashboard so yeah pretty cool to see monthly okay it does load it is loading pretty slowly but i think this is like live basically yeah, it is taking time to, yeah there you go it's the graph and everything so yeah average last month 36 okay tps tps also 48 so yeah pretty interesting to see this is in the last last like month here so pretty cool 
pretty cool to see what's been happening. You can check out networks, the devs, use cases, and so many different things. So there have been like a lot of D apps from this network here, which is pretty much really good. It just shows you that people are using this, like developers are creating like apps, D apps through this token here. So first thing first, I want to talk about this. This one, the 2nd September, saying the latest release of Hedera service code version 0.17.4 on main it includes updates to the Hedera token service, so NFTs, custom fees including NFT royalties, metadata standards for tokens, awesome. Implementation of NFTs is going to be really really good, so this is basically why this coin is exploding right now. So NFTs are really the huge craze right now, people are making a lot of money through NFTs, it is really tricky but it's really interesting at the same time. This is in the second part of our custom fees tutorial. Uh, this company here shows you how to associate tokens with accounts, create tokens, transfers, and query account balances. So, like I said, if you are to go check out their apps here, they have some really interesting apps. They are posting here a lot, not gonna lie, it is pretty okay every single day almost, which is pretty okay. How much? I mean, let's just check out how many followers they actually have. They have 130,000 followers, which is just pretty cool to see. They are verified here, so pretty cool. Just really good things are happening here to this coin. And let's go check out the price. Let's go check out the chart right now. Some price. Let's do some price analysis. Look at this. This is what's been happening here, here to this coin. This is the four hour chart. You can already see that this coin is just pumping like crazy. Like this is pretty much insane to see. So let's just measure how much this coin did increase. So first gonna measure if you bought the dip here. Imagine if you bought the dip. So if you bought the dip right over here, let's, let's say it's over here. Basically, the coin in the last seven days did increase 113%, maybe even all the way to here, 118% in the last seven days. In just the last seven days, that's pretty insane. But let's actually look at the indicators because these two lines here show you when you need to buy the coin. So, let's check out a genuine cross. So, if you do check it out, the last time they made a pretty nice cross here, that's all the way to here in the, at the 24th of July. It shows you that you should have bought the coin right over here at that level. So imagine if you bought the coin right then and there. So basically at this level right over here, and if you go all the way to here, basically it's 200% increase already in just two months here, which is just amazing. Like these coins are not coins that are gonna go like 20x or something like that because the market caps for these, these coins are already huge. But these are coins that uh, are good for like huge investments. So if you can have like 10k, like even more then of course it's a lot better for you to invest in this coin and get like 200 percent increase and in like triple your investment instead of investing into like a small altcoin that can drop by 50 percent the next day so this is why this coin is really good for something like that and people are investing like we just saw 1.2 billion dollars in volume in the last 24 hours which is insane to see and insane to think about so super cool super cool this coin has continued to go like we had some kind of crosses here but these are like fake outs so you have to still wait even if you see like a bearish cross you still have to check it out what's going to happen in a couple of days because you can see how this is just a fake out basically we did cross for the bearish cross but we crossed for a bullish cross literally like a couple of hours later like one day or two days later and that's it again here almost made the cross but we continue to go up and now explosion just a huge huge explosion here which is pretty cool now let's check out what's going to happen this coin Basically, we are in an upsetting funnel. We are still continuing to go up. We're not seeing any pullback. The RSI, the RSI right now is pretty overbought. So you have to remember that the base we're going to have a correction. So this coin has been going up, but do remember the correction is going to happen to this coin eventually, of course. So every coin has a correction and that's like seeing this coin having correction is going to be pretty normal. Now, uh, when that, when is that correction going to be? I can't really know that, but we can just try and check out some price targets. So. If we take this Fibonacci, if we place it right over here, we can see how much is the next price target. The next price target is going to be, a, let's say it's 0 0.7. So that's the next price target. So 0 0.7 is going to be a next price target for this coin. After that, we have 0 0.9, then 1.2, then 1.35. That's it. These are the levels that this coin should be able to go to if you do continue to go up. Now, the problem is, like I said, is the RSI. So the RSI, is super is like literally overbought right now you can see that what happened before is that we we did reach this level and we had some whales basically selling here by a lot let's just check out how much is it sell if we go from here to here it was a 30 percent decrease in just 
couple of hours here so do remember that that something like this could happen to this coin where this coin will be able to just break down pretty easy now like i said if we do continue just like this if we continue to go up and we should because we're gonna have the two-year anniversary on the 16th so tomorrow so seeing that should make the coin just explode now like i said two things could happen now, either they're gonna release something really interesting on the two-year anniversary and just because of that we're gonna have another massive pump or because it is the anniversary where it's going to break down so do remember like this happened to cardano where cardano had like launched their smart contracts but and a lot of people did think that cardano will break to the top side but in the end cardano did break to the downside and actually it, did, it is still stabilizing but it did break to the downside we didn't really continue to go up so these things like these huge like events do happen where in the end the, the coin could break down because the lead up to that event made the coin just explode that's it so the lead up is the whole point but there's like a, always a chance that if everything is just massively good the good thing is going to start to happen now a good sign also for this coin is that look at the volume so we had a ton of volume here but look at what's happening now we have a ton of volume again so we actually have more volume like in this like little wick here than this one here and that's pretty much insane like that's super insane to see because basically we were just but we had like a selling part we have to remember like we had a lot of selling part right over here but that means people bought like people did buy a lot of coins here so what i'll say here is just basically that we are still increasing for the volume you can just see how slowly we are going up more and more into the volume let's go here to the one hour chart we want to see a little bit more detail but yeah it's always making the same graph where we are making like a flag here so if you can see the pattern where we do make a flag we do stabilize and we pump up flag stabilize pump up flag stabilize pump up boom flag stabilize so flags and stabilization so next couple of hours stabilization if we can make another flag like there could be like a chance that we need to go and break down of course and then try to go up again so something like that could be possible because this is what the coin has been doing for the last couple of days going up stabilization correction boom they always just hitting these levels boom 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 it's not just like a straight up the stabilization then up it's like up stabilization then down up stabilization like a little bit down there you go so this is like the pattern up stabilization down up stabilization down so if the pattern is correct like we we're gonna we're going up right now stabilization a little bit then we're gonna go down probably how much can we go down we're gonna go down probably if i do if i'm right it should go to this level here or maybe even lower like there's a chance it's gonna go all the way maybe back to this high the hope is going to find some stabilization right over here. So something like this, where we do go a little bit of stabilization, go to here, and then we continue to go up. That would be pretty good. I think something like that is possible right now for this coin, like for it to hit the 0 0.4 level, because we should be we should be able to have like some uh, buying power here. I mean, like some. Like, you should be you should be having some safety here at this level, just because of this level before. So hopefully it's gonna bounce up that way. If not, then this level right over here. We're gonna go all the way down to hitting this line and then bouncing off. That's the best bullish scenario I can see for this coin. But if something bad happens, then we're gonna break down. How much can we break down? Well, let's say that we're gonna break down by 30% because 30% happened before in the past. So let's say that we could be able to go 30% down. If we do measure from here to 30%, means we're gonna go back all the way to here so do remember that if we're gonna if we're gonna have a correction there's going to be probably a 30 percent correction that's exactly what happened before so if it happened before it can happen now but people did buy the dip so it did fix it so do remember that something like this could happen the market like i said is 5 billion so can we go even more the market for this coin could go to like 10 billion i do believe that can we go even more than 10 billion there is a chance but that's still a lot of volume like i know a person here in my video say like 10 billion vol like 10 billion market cap is not much but you have to remember 10 billion you, do you understand how much is 10 billion dollars like that's a huge 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 number there but like i said if you go to come here cap you get a look at the the top coins actually you can just see that basically the top coins you have like look at this market cap 800 yeah it's 800 here 400 cardano 76 that's the difference here so that's the difference between ethereum uh, Bitcoin and Cardano here. It's just that 
you have to know it's the big difference between Bitcoin, Ethereum, and the rest of the coins because these two have just large mark caps. But these are super popular. Right? Everybody knows about these coins, and that's it. But for Hedera, not everybody knows about Hedera, and, and that's why it's super hard for it to get to at least like those like 50 or 60 or 70. It's not going to reach Bitcoin anytime soon, but reaching Cardano to 80 billion, I still think that's going to be impossible. So 10 to 15, maybe even 20, that's by the end of the bull run if we have like, if Bitcoin reaches like 100,000 per Bitcoin, $100,000 per Bitcoin, then Hedera has a chance to reach like 15 billion or something like that. But now a lot of patience, but good things are happening. Good things are happening here to this coin. In the end, guys, I'm not a financial advisor. If you do want to buy these coins, please do your own research first. If you did enjoy this video, I mean, search me. If you can like this video, comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next video.